Hello everyone, and we are back with some more Hearthstone. Um, I thought I'd try something a bit different today, so instead of Constructed, what I've decided to do is we're going to do Arena instead. Now I've got 1950 gold, so I've got more than enough to get... What? 700? Oh, about 150 short. So I'm about 300 short of getting all the wings uh, prepaid, so that's fine. So I sure I can make up for that amount of money. But we'll see what we can do. Okay, uh, Hunter, Warlock, or Paladin? Hmm, I don't really know the War Hunter. Warlock's usually always nice. And then we've got Uther, Lightbringer, the Paladin. Hmm, I might do Warlock, I think. Alright, so what have we got? Blood Sail Corsair, Injured Blade Master, or Gadgetan Auctioneer. I think I'll take the Injured Blade Master. Oh god. Oasis Snapjaw, Murloc Tide Hunter, or Bloodfen Raptor. I might take the Oasis Snapjaw. Hmm. Let's Yeah, Brain Life. Ooh. Oh. Um, you know what? Deathwing. That's rubbish. That's been nerfed. Yeah, Deathwing. Uh, Demon Fire. Mm, don't have a demon at the moment. Dark Skill Healer. Venture Code Mercenary. Always good. Uh, ooh. That's a bit hit and miss. Siphon Soul, again, always useful. But that can be too in the right circumstances, but I don't really have. Yeah, I think I'll take the Siphon Soul. Oh, uh, yeah, for Golem. Decent stats. Oh, oh um, that's actually a tough one. Uh, Sentient Shield Master is always useful. A 6 Swamp is not always, so I'll take the Sentient Shield Master. Uh, Cult Master, yeah, it's always a good card to have. Ah, uh, ooh. Problem is, I've got only one card to trigger this, but then I don't have any spells. Well, I've got two spells. I've got Drain Life and Siphon Soul, so... I'm thinking the Ruby and Egg. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, we can always take a second Drain... Oh, don't... Drain Life or Power Overwhelming. I'll take Power Overwhelming. It's still a way to activate the Nerubian Egg. It's always useful to have, too. Um... Hmm. 6-6. Six, six. Rhyme Beak out. I think I'll take the Dread Infernal. But I need to start getting some lower-end minions. Uh... I'll take the Hellfire. Hmm. Cult Master again. Silverback Patriot. Or Youthful Brewmaster. Um... The thing is, I don't really have any minions that... I can pull back yet, so I'll take the Cult Master again, I think. Uh, Shadow Bolt's always good. Uh, that's kinda rubbish, actually. But then so is everything else. But the stats are horrible. This is a 3 2 3 with Wind Fury. Yeah, this might work. Uh, another Sentient Shield Master. I really need some 1 and 2s. Uh, Flame Imp. Great. Uh, summoning... Oh, I'll take the Blood from Raptor. Oh! Oh! Shit. Okay. Um... Wow. Okay, so that's a 5-5 five, five guaranteed. But it's applic... Uh, that could be really applicable... If I come across a warrior or a paladin or a hunter, Tinker Rock or Silver Spark, really don't want to take that card. So it's definitely between these two, Harrison Jones or Lotheb. I'm probably leaning towards Lotheb. The stats are a little bit better, and even if he doesn't have a spell, it's still a 5 5, and it might still slow him down. So I'll take the Lotheb. Even though I think it's not great, but then neither is Harrison Jones, in my opinion. At least not in. Uh, Voidwalker? Uh, I'll take a chill when DS I think, and then got... Um, Imp Master, always nice. Voodoo Doctor, Summoning Portal, Mortal Coil. Coil. 
Uh, ooh, Crazed Alchemist, that could prove to be handy, or I don't really have that many spells. That's the thing, so I'll take the Crazed Alchemist. Ooh, this is... How many ones have I got? I've got one, two, I bet there's two of those. Ah. Uh, how many demons have I got? I'll have ooh, at least what one, two, three, four. I've got a few demons. It might be worth a demon fire. Oh, I don't want to throw out another minion because how many minions, low-level minions, have I got? Uh, I'll take the Void Walker. Uh, Earth and Ring Farseer, always nice. Chill and Yeti, that's pretty obvious. Okay, so we got the Void Terror, the Sun Fury Protector, and the Questing Adventurer. Um, well, with the number of ones and twos I get, uh, this Questing Adventurer might be okay. Void Terror is a bit hit and miss. Sun Fury Protector would give taunt. Yeah, I can live with that. Let's do that then. Uh, what have we got? Ooh, okay. So, Secret Keeper, Arcane Golem, Injured Blade Master. Well, that's useless. Forget that. Arcane Golem, Right Circumstances, pretty nice. Yeah, I'll take the Arcane Golem. Okay, so this should be interesting. Uh, I'm not sure how well this will work. I'm. Um, I'm a bit sort of hit and miss. It seems to be a very... It's a decent early game and then like not much to very little towards the end. So I need to sort of... This is definitely going to be sort of a zoo style rush down. So let's get started and see what we can do. My arena runs are pretty hit and miss. Like uh, sometimes... I have gotten to 11-3 before. Um... Seven's usually around my average, I guess. Um, but then sometimes I can get some real stinkers, like everyone can, so... Let's see. Oh! This is actually a pretty nice opening hand. I think I'll keep this opening hand. That's a really nice one. Maybe you could have gotten rid of the Mortal Coil, but... No, nah, it's alright. I like it. Which begs the question, what do I play next turn, I wonder? Um, Sun Fury Protector, or do I Life Tap? Life Tapping against a hunt is dangerous. At least, well, not so much at this stage, but... What's he gonna play? What's he gonna play? Hmm. What are you going to play, Hunter? Hmm. Oh, nothing. Okay. Um... I want to taunt it? No. Yeah, let's just do this. Why do you cool. Now I got really good board. Now I got some good solid board control. And with the combine with that mortal coil, we can take out anything from one to four. One to four health minion quite comfortably. And we got a siphon soul in our hands, which is excellent. Hmm. Indeed. What are you doing? What are you going to do? I want to know. You gotta play something. He's... Okay. Ooh. That's... mildly irritating, actually. Um... I might just trade out... Well, hang on. Yeah, let's... As you command. Yeah, I'll trade it out. Oh, you idiot! Simon, you... ah! I am such a numpty. Can't be targeted by spells at a hero pass. I'm tired. <laughs> this is probably a bad time to do an arena run. Oh dear. I am such an idiot. 
Oh, he's going to get two for one value on that thing now. That is such a stupid play. Oh, I'm really kicking myself for that. Now you're going to run your 3-1 into my 3-2, and I'm going to be really annoyed. Ah, he's playing a secret. Uh, let's life tap. Okay, that'll be good for the next turn, so let's just... Shields up. That's fine. I still got value out of it because I activated my Nerubian Egg, so I'm happy with that. So I'm absolutely... That's absolutely fine. Like, it's irritating, don't get me wrong, but... Um, the fact that I can get my Nerubian Egg taunted, it means a whole lot. I was actually kind of hoping it was going to be an explosive trap. Uh, but... You know, that's hopeful. I can't imagine he'd actually play that with a 0-2 on the board because that's just instant easy activation. So now it's guaranteed. Yeah, that's activated. So now that's really good situation to have. Uh, next turn, I think it's Lotheb. Game Staller, always good. And then it's actually quite funny. Like, yeah, you play this on turn straight away on turn 5. Mm -hmm. Like, basically anything he could have played in his previous turn. Well, yeah, anything he... Never mind. I'm thinking too much about it. But yeah, I think it's definitely going to be my next play. Um, depending, well, it depends what he does. Um, it's nice to have the two heals in my hands. Okay, that's getting... Oh. I want to throw out Lotheb. No, I can't risk him drawing cards. No, I can't risk him drawing cards. So, let's see what I get first. Oh, an Ascension Shieldmaster. Um, Numbers-wise, it's actually better to throw out the Senjin. It's more mana efficient. So let's actually do that. Even though it gets him a choice between the two, which is fun. Doesn't, you know, it's a to it's going to get activated eventually, or... Either I'm going to... He could silence it, I suppose. But... Yeah, yeah, you've got to be kidding me! Okay. I think I'm just going to siphon soul that. That's perfect. Lovely. This is going reasonably well so far. Um, next turn, probably Chillwind Yeti with the Earthen Ring Fast here. The alternative is to Lotheb. Uh, Lotheb Life Tap. Seems like a reasonably good option. So yeah, I've got a good. I'm in a good zone at the moment. Lothar life tap seems like a good option because it means I can. Um, I'm hesitant to play the Venture Co Mercenary now, but oh, well, it's three more, so that becomes a six cost heal, which isn't great. So, Earthering Farsi is definitely out. Quickly. Actually, no, Earthering Farsi is still viable. He's got to run that in, um, into my 0 2. Mm -hmm. What are you going to play? Is he just BMing me? Okay, so... Oh, Hellfire activates it. And then I just heal up. Ooh, that could be really good. Hellfire, activate. Heal. Don't have to rely on it. I wonder... I think I'll do that, actually. That sounds like a pretty good plan. that up. Excellent. So now I've got a 4-4, four, four, a 3-3 three, three on the field with 24 health. Um, only three cards, but obviously I'm a warlock. I can easily get more. And I've got some pretty decent cards in my hand too. So, um... To my side. What does he get? Oh, nuts. Just gonna run that into the 4-4, four, four, I imagine. Blood and plunder. 
Okay. Well, no, this is arena, so... Oh, uh, he knows he's going to get perfect trades out of this, so there's no reason for him to throw anything else out. Okay. Or... Or... Let's do... Oh, if he's got a kill command, though. What's the odds he's got two? Don't want to risk it. I wonder... The whole thing about this is board control, and if I get those two onto the field, I'm going to have really good board control, so... Yeah, I think I might do that instead. Yeah, let's get rid of it. I don't like it on the field. I'd rather have... clear board his side. The next turn... Hmm... One Lothar, Anglethorn Tiger, okay. Is he playing? Oh, has he got a kill command again? Hopefully not. Okay, Engine Blade Master. Cool. I think this turn I was going to. I think that was my phone. Uh, let's life tap first, see what we get. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna do this, I think. I see. <laughs> Clear that off or go. Because that can kill. Yeah, let's just ping this off. And go through space. Yeah, let's do that. That worked. What's that my phone? I can't remember. Where's my phone? Where is my phone? Oh, it's over there. Can't be bothered doing that now. Okay. So the 2 5 into the 3 1, the 5 5 into the 5 5, leaving me with a 4 5 and we potentially must something cleanse else. The sun oh, well. he's keeping letting it survive. Yep. 6 6 into the 5. Really? I wouldn't have seen that coming. Okay, oh, I can get some real value here. So let's do this. Let's, yeah, because that can kill either one. Oh, so this is tough. Do I go for a Do I play control or do I go for the f face? Uh. So whenever one of your other... That's 6-2. It's only 5 damage and I can comp... Yeah, let's do that. What do I get? Oh! Nice! Um, I don't really want to use that this turn, though. So yes. Let's give him something to deal with, because I've got 11 damage. Oh, if I can get one more of those, I can win this game. We've got stronger minions. Those trade, but nothing trades with what he's... Yeah, he's got two cards, and he's got to deal with Avenger Code Mercenary. Now, obviously, these have become much more expensive. Irritating, I but... Wonder. He's still got to find a way to deal with them. Oh, that's... That's fine, actually. No, that's fine. Yep, is he going to trade it out, or how's he going to do this? Yep, he's just going to trade. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, so... I can get a nice strong board again. So, uh, but I think I'll just do... This with that. He's got a seven, I've got a 7-7 seven, seven on the field. He's got nothing on his side of the board. <laughs> You've got one card to play, mate. There's not much to it. <laughs> hmm. So the next turn, obviously, will be always the Snapjaw Engine Blade Master. To play your card. Okay. Let's 
four, two, seven. Yeah, that's easy lethal next turn, so. Uh, yeah, I see no reason. Just, just ignore it and go for face. Uh, do I wanna. Ah, what are the odds? Oh, excellent. Why do you fall? Cool, that worked out. Ah, go cool. victory. I apologize in advance if this is a long video. Um, I hope it's not. Um, but we'll see how we go. Splitting these videos into parts isn't particularly easy with the software I'm using. It doesn't like Premiere Pro very much. Actually, I lied. It's actually probably quite easy to split it. I think to, if I'm right, I just check something out. Okay, so we're going up against a druid. We're going second. Uh, get rid of the cult master. Get rid of the second cult master. Uh, I might hold on to it. Uh, or probably get better something better. I'll keep the Nerubian egg though. Good enough ones and twos. Uh, it's not great, but it's not horrible. The light protects me. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what to do here. Except then turn. Idiot. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. My gut is telling me, but then no, get the Ninja Blade Master out. It's a 4 3. He could wrap it quite easily, but we need to get something on the board. We need to start absorbing some of this damage. Even if it's just, you know. So, how's he gonna do this? He's gonna run straight into face, or. Okay. Dra oh no, he's gonna still gonna take 4 damage, which is fine. Uh, Blood Friend Raptor. Easy choice. And turn. I realize I'm such an idiot that I can split this. This is really easy to split into parts. I'm just... Okay. Oh, that's an easy. Um, mortal. Wow, another claw. Fair enough. Oops. Um. Hmm. I think we just have to send to Shield Master. Oh, it does. Yeah, let's send. Let's mortal coil. Get rid of that. Draw a card. Oh, excellent. Ruby and egg this up, and then end turn. So next turn, if I want to, I can either send you in power or both ebb. They'll never know what hit them. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to send you in power overwhelming. Get rid of that four four. Cool. And I get a 4-4 back. That works really nicely. Unless he's got... Okay, swipe. So he's just going to trade that. Oh, wow. Really sort of draining the board. Ooh. Might save that combo later, or... I haven't done any damage to him yet, which is a real problem. I think it's ha oh, let's tap first. So, yeah, then send him. <laughs> He's used a lot of cards, though. I mean, I've got some semblance. Like, I've got card advantage, but I just... And I've got board advantage, actually, at this point. Are you ready for this? Oh, please give me an opportunity to just kill that thing first. Oh, yes, I've got it. I've got the opportunity. I see you. 
Yeah, put on this side. Or do I run into that? No, I've got guaranteed lethal next turn, so he can run into that if he wants to. Although I just did put it in swipe range. Has he got a swipe? We must cleanse the sun well. Okay. All right, I know what I'm going to do. So, yeah, okay. That trades. Draw a card. Oh, excellent. Get two health back, get a taunt in place, and go in the face. Right, so now I've got a really solid board. I just hope it's enough I can start making a comeback. Fingers crossed, I can start making a comeback now. Uh, I got the best deals anywhere. Has he got a way to get ah oh, he does have a way to get rid of it? Uh, yeah, no, I can clear that. So let's play, yeah, or, or, yeah. Oh, wait, no, I can't do that. Forget that. Yeah, definitely don't want to make that mistake. Okay, so that, that. Okay, yeah, now there's that, there's that. that. Go on a life tap now. Not really, but I need some extra cards, so let's do one. Alright. We're at half health. I've got the better board still. Or even on cards. He's got a definite life advantage. Wow, he really spelled up his deck, didn't he? I must safeguard the land. Jeez. That's irritating. Okay. Well, I think the best play... Get that out. Get that out. Run into his face. Keep that board control as best I can. He's doing a great job of keeping my board clear. I have to give him credit for that. Yeah, he's going to have to trade. Oh, wow. Is he going for my face or is he going for the... Which one's he going for? Wow. Oh. Not yet. We are not there yet. So I'm going to load up this with this. I'm not life tapping, but I'm going to go for this. But I want to keep the control. Let's keep the control. I'm a control player. It's just what happens. Probably should have just gone for face. It was probably safe to go for face, but I just did not want to risk it. It's outside of swipe range, and he's going to have to hit it with something else if he wants to clear that. Okay. Fine, he's going to get a card. How many cards has he got left? 12 from my 11. Drawing another card. Ruby and Egg. But I'm not going to activate it, so... Not unless I have to. I'm just holding on to this, but yeah. What's he going to do? Has he got a swipe? Or has he got a... Oh, he's going to... Okay, so he's going to wrap. And then throw himself into that. Okay. Reasonable. Well, since I'm not going to be playing the Deathwing anytime soon. Yeah, yeah, you've got to be kidding me! Turn. I don't, I'm not going to life tap. I'm happy with... I don't need any extra cards at the moment. Behold the might of Stormwind! Okay, so he's going to trade. Which one's he going to run it into? Hmm, ok. 
Okay. If I run... I need to clear that board, though. Unfortunately, no matter how I do it, he's going to come out ahead. Seven fourteen to yeah. Uh, yeah, no matter how I, no matter how I do it, he's gonna come out ahead. But if I get rid of, I get rid of his Stormwind Champion. The alternative is, of course, I. He's only got one card. It's a guarant. It wouldn't be a guaranteed lead. Well, would it? I wonder. Seven, six, nine, twelve. It would be a guaranteed lethal if he can get if he can't get rid of it. So I'm actually kind of happy to do that. So let's run that into that. Oh, it's one off. My math sucks. I forgot about his armor. I forgot about the armor. Now he's just trying to rush me down. We must cleanse the Sunwell. Mm -hmm. Drain life, siphon soul, hellfire. That will do it. And we have victory. Ha ha, nice. Top deck to Hellfire. Awesome. Oh, we got a card reward too. So, battle number two done. All right, we'll do one more battle and then I will pause the. I will stop this video and restart with part two. So you guys aren't watching hour after hour. You can actually split it up into parts so we can see how this arena run does. Gul'dan versus okay, we're up against Brawl. Shaman. For Doomhammer, your soul shall first. be mine. Uh, get keep the mortal coil. Get rid of the Deathwing. I might hold on to the Hellfire. Ah, nah, get rid of the Hellfire. Dig for a turn one. Ugh, I was hoping for a decent turn one play. Hmm, but I've got some good answers to whatever he throws out, so if that's a potential turn, that'll be probably turn two, that'll be probably turn three. Yeah, life tap. Cool. So we're in a decent spot. Uh, Injured Blade Master's probably going to go out next. Yep. Or... Yeah, no, it's Injured Blade Master. It's vulnerable to Lightning Bolt, but I don't see anything else I can play. Yeah. Okay. Um. Uh, hmm. Someone keeps texting me. I'm not sure who it is. I'll check after this. Joy or die, or both. I might just see what the guys are about quickly. Oh, I don't. Okay, that's what it is. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, I think I can. Okay, let's do. Yeah, let's do that. So, two. Oh, I should have done that play first. I can do it now. Okay. Uh, let's throw out the taunt minion. This is better maths, but now nah, it's. <laughs> How many cards has he got? Nine. Okay. No, all right. Oh, I still get a card out of it, so that's cool. Ooh, a golem. Oh, nicely done. Nice 
Finally done clearing my board. Um, I'm happy with this. Good enough time as any to play it. Has he got a hex or? Feel the power. Oh, he's really going for it. Okay, so I can. Hmm. War golem, maybe. It is a big minion, so let's get it on the field. He's only got three damage. I've got Hellfire Shadow about and power overwhelming, so ah, there's the hex. Okay. Ah. Uh, yeah, I think Hellfire with uh, Chu and Yeti is a good play as any. Gives me board control. Um, they're a bit off on cards, but that's okay. The gates are open. All right, all right. Uh, I can't comfortably kill that, which is a bit irritating. I have to use a shadow bolt or a power overwhelming as well. I don't want to use a sh power overwhelming. Let's life tap, see what we can get. Oh, okay, cool. So I'm a little less annoyed by that. Uh, yeah, let's get this. Uh, do I really want to... No, let's... Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so... So many possibilities. Uh, no, let's do this. It's going to die anyway. It's not. Where's my card? Oh, what am I talking about? There's my card. When it dies, you fool. <laughs> Just think. What? What? The, oh, wait, it's still alive. Oh, bugger. I do have the death wing though, so I've got oh, definitely got some decent options. Okay. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Let's play that. Cool. So I've still got the death wing sitting in my hand, ready to pounce whenever I need it to. Does dingo! Okay. Yes. Does dingo? Sometimes I What is with all the spellness on this like tour? Um Well on the plus side, at least I can make some of it pointless. That gives that gives it plus one to adjacent, so that's plus one, plus one, that's plus one. Oh, good grief. Okay, so... So many possibilities. Yeah. I see. Shields up! Cool, so let's make sure that if he's going to try and bust through, he can't do it with spell damage. He's going to use minions. I'm not letting him get away with that. Any big spell is going to cost him a small fortune. Yep. 2-5. You're going to run the 2-5. Come on. There it is. He knew you were going to do Don't that. Don't mess with Tusker. Wow, that Deathwing is looking more and more awesome. <laughs> ah, good grief. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna... Well, actually no. 
harm and life tapping, actually. <gasps> Ooh. How many could I kill with that? Quite a few. Oh, I can kill one. What am I on about? I can kill one. Uh... No, let's play... Hmm. I'm actually on pretty decent health. So what I'm going to do, actually, I'm going to do a little bit of trickery here. No, nope. morning person. Run that into that. What am I more afraid of? The damage? Or... I got this. He obviously had a plan. I want to get rid of a spell damage totem. But I just want to get rid of two damage. Well, let's get rid of a spell damage totem. And keep a minion on the board. Because I'm tired of him healing too. My eyes are open. Cool. Well done. Hopefully now it's not quite as easy for him to clear the board. To Northrend! Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see. Well, that's going to die anyway. So I both of those would die to that. So if I do that, that's that could survive. Okay, this. so let's do that. Do this. Play that. And play this. Kill. So now I've got very much board control. He's got a little bit of health advantage. Definitely card advantage. Oh, that's nasty. And a hex. On my 6-6. Six, six. Yay! <sighs> I'm not quite panicking about a death wing yet. Let's light tap. Mm-hmm. Do I want to want to? I think the best move might just be not attacking at all, because I can always get that. Or... Let's not attack, because the three two is just going to die. I can use the death wing. So let's see what he plays. Oh. Please dump your hand. Oh, he's dumped the majority of his hand. Okay. Oh. Hmm. I'm wondering if. Well, no, that would get me a 12 12 and a 4 4. So many. Possibilities. You know what? It's a. It was a bit of a waste of cards, but I was going to lose them anyway. Yeah. Well played. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that worked really well. That worked out really well for me. Oh, fan fantastic. All right, cool. All right, cool. Let's get that on. Let's get that in. Clear that off. <laughs> that Deathwing's turning out to be the, like, primo choice for this deck. It's just like, boom. What are you going to do about it? Yeah, I've won. Unless he's got another toy. Yeah, cool. Three nil so far, so I think we'll definitely stop it there, but we'll pick this up very, very shortly. That was a bit weird, but okay. Yes! 
So we're 3-0. Deathwing is the hero of this deck so far. But yes. Anyway, sorry, Ooh, excuse me. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you liked this video. Um, please hit the like button, hit the comment, subscribe, hit the little, little subscribe button down there. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, I think I think it's going pretty well so far, if I'm honest. But we'll see how we keep uh, see how we get on. But um, yes, part two I'll be recording straight after this one, and I'll be uploading this one very shortly. So. Although, unless you're actually subscribed and immediately watch, it's probably irrelevant. Um, but yes, thank you for watching, and goodbye.